not seeing double. We are back with the dynamic Italian duo, John and Tony Alberti, who are here to help us create the perfect pasta dish for all of our amazing Hallmark movies this weekend. And we do have a lot to watch. Now joining Cam at the counter is Robbie Benson because he said he's not leaving unless he gets a chance to eat some of this Italian pasta. As he should not. He's I mean, absolutely. about this, as is Larissa. So yes. you guys Go. dive in. This is really delicious. Boys, I'd like to say congratulations on Twintastico. Thank, Thank you. you. It's your first yes. Thank, you. Thank you. You've been at this for a long time, but you finally yes. put it into some pages on a yes. book that people can all have at home now. Your parents must be so proud. Yeah, well, we all say, like, look at us. They've got to be proud, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the book, it takes you on a, you know, Twintastico, it takes you on a journey for a traditional Italian meal from start to finish. And we love to be creative in the kitchen as well, so there's lots of Twintastico twists we do on, you know, on classic recipes along the way yeah. as well. Nice. There's lots about us in the book, our Italian heritage, our family, and most importantly, there's lots of pictures of us. So <laughs> it's a win-win for everyone, really. There's lots of pictures of them and a few recipes. A few recipes. Yeah, 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 right. it's so humble as ever. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? We try, we try. One of the recipes in the book is this delicious pasta alla vongole, which yes. is basically yes. pasta with clams, right? Yes, <laughs> yes, actually. You know, it's an Italian classic as just, well. Yeah, just like us. You know, it's really quick and simple <laughs> to make as well. So it's like very fresh and vibrant. And the most important thing is to use fresh clams. Okay. okay. Fresh the better. Oh, gosh, yeah. you can I think see the fresh. someone moving as well. Yes. <laughs> That's how fresh they are. They're, yeah. they're on go. the go. Yeah. So it starts with sautéing some garlic and some red pepper flakes, Yes. Correct? Yes. So first you'd add the olive oil into the pan. Okay. You drill that in, you put a bit more than that. Of course, Italian olive oil. Yeah, obviously. Everything's okay. Italian. Always got Italian Can cooks. Can you use Greek Italian. olive oil? Never. We invented <laughs> olive oil, so Sorry, the Deb. Greeks just followed. Yeah, <laughs> I, don't know about I didn't that. know Greek olive oil existed. Oh, very good. <laughs> Those are fighting words. I shouldn't have brought it up. I apologize. Continue, please. Yeah. <laughs> so you just add your um, uh, olive oil and your garlic. Okay. Then we have your pepperoncino chili flakes, but you can use fresh chilies if you want. And the great thing about this is that this recipe can spice up your love life as well. You that's what our book's about. <laughs> that's what our book's about family and food. And being with the family together. Just cooking together as a family, really, yeah. and eating together at the table again. How long do you do the garlic and the red pepper flakes without them burning? Yeah, you just until they're golden. Yeah, you just want it so golden. And once they're golden, then you add in your white wine. Okay. And, and yes. then the clams as well. All right. I do have to say, this no, is delicious. very good and very flavorful. Don't lift the pan, they're very hot. <laughs> Okay, so we put so the yeah, wine so we put in. Have you guys met Larissa? I, yeah, we met her last time. Sure. We met her last time. Right. Okay. She, she is so, yeah. our pet rescue expert and also available. She can rescue us. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Is that why I'm sitting here? <laughs> Larissa, you know, we do our best. So, yeah, so once you put the clams in and the okay. white wine, you just leave that to simmer for around Ooh. five minutes. All right. Okay, and the beautiful thing about this is once you start to cook it, the clams will start to open All right. and they release the briny juices, and this helps flavor the sauce and gives it that unforgettable flavor. Yeah. Mm. So, exactly. it's key if they don't open, you throw them out, right? Yeah, exactly. If they're yeah. not open once you've cooked, just throw them out. Don't risk it. Let's get rid of now, them. When you're buying clams, how many do you buy? Because some you're going to have to throw out, right? Yeah, you use them as a bag, and just usually you use like a couple of handfuls. You know, you really. cook for a big Italian family, so nothing ever goes to waste anyway. Yeah. You always never have That's leftovers. True. Yeah, exactly. And, and then, uh, is there a specific type of clam you like? Yeah, we, we're using Manila uh, clams now, but you can use Little Necks, um, yeah. whatever you... Um, as long as it's fresh, that's the most important thing. Okay. Yes. And then next, you would get your pan of boiling water on the go. You'd season it with salt. We all say we want it as um, salty as the Mediterranean Sea. Okay. That'll flavour the pasta. And then you want to cook that until it's al dente, which means to the bite. So you've got a bit of bite to it, to the tooth. Mm -hmm. And then when you've cooked that, you want to drain it and add it to the sauce. Okay. Yeah, so you just want to pop that in. And then you just want to give it a good toss together. That's it? Yep, yeah, you nice and easy and mix. quick. We all say the key to Italian food is simplicity. Well, you know? that's true because you can't hide behind exactly. anything. Exactly. And I believe it's in a lot of chefs, like you guys will probably agree with me, that the most difficult dishes are the ones that are simple. Yeah, exactly. the one with less ingredients because they're the ones speaking volumes to you right. as you're cooking, really. So then you add in your fresh parsley. You can season with a bit of salt and pepper if you want. And then yeah. serve. Exactly. Yes, right? exactly. Any more olive oil? No, no. We could all like finish that? with a pinch of olive oil just at the okay. end. There you go. Very Listen, good. I got to ask you guys, uh, as good, uh, oh, you know, Mama's boys, yes. Mother's Day's coming My up. Mom is. Yes. Favorite cooking tip that you learned from your mother? We all say, like, uh, when you're cooking in the kitchen, the most important ingredient in the kitchen will always be love. If you cook with love and passion, you're going to get amazing food. Unless you're a really yeah. bad cook. <laughs> and you're gonna get rid of bad food. <laughs> Probably just get better getting us to cook it for you. Oh, yeah. moms. But, yeah. oh, we gotta right. get in here. We gotta oh, hold oh, on, boys. All right. You ready? Yeah, we can do the lady in the tramp, the spaghetti kiss. Oh, oh. okay. You know, yeah. <laughs> three, three ways. <laughs> Who's gonna be the lady? <laughs> Definitely you. 